which is such a weird precedent to set to set because we all yeah. know how long, how many years it takes of that free upfront labor, blood, sweat, and tears. Totally. And by the way, it's not just confined to independent film. I just recently sold my first limited series to a, you know, big buyer. And I was shocked to learn that producers of television series also don't get paid until you're in production. Only the writer gets paid. And I was like, what? Like, how does how you're, we're expected to develop scripts with the writer for free. I don't understand that at all. And, you know, it's, it's, it's because most television producers have deals with studios already. And so like, right. they, you know, they're sort of covered, but when you're an independent, you don't have a deal with the television studio. It's sort of like, you're shit out of luck. Can yeah. I, come? is that okay? Yeah, gonna... absolutely. Okay. It's, in, it's actually encur <laughs> highly encouraged. Right. <laughs> Great. Yeah, we... so, um, I can speak the language of my writers and directors. Um, and at the same time, I'm also sort of like, you know, pretty, very organized and like pretty math oriented and business oriented. And so, and I think there's actually a lot of creativity um, in like business strategy as well yeah. that I relish. And so I think producing is like the perfect fit for my personality. So. Yeah. So if you had to define a producer, how would you define one? Oh my God, that's so hard to do. Um, the producer is an enabler. It, it, you know, <laughs> producer is like the wizard behind the curtain uh, who like, puts the whole circus together and, um, you know, basically does everything except for write, direct and act. <laughs> so, <laughs> and even in some cases we have to do that too. Right. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's just that the puppet, the puppet master, <laughs> that's the producer. Yeah. How do you feel like so far in your career, the producer title, right? Like carrying that title has defined you as a person, as a woman? That is a, that's a good question. I mean, it, because it encompasses so many things and so many functions and characteristics, um, I think that, you know, like a producer nurtures, a producer enables, you know, uh, a producer acts as a firefighter and a psychiatrist, uh, sorry, not a psychiatrist, a psychologist. <laughs> Sometimes a psychiatrist, sometimes you can give them drugs. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. And, uh, it, and just like, you know, multitasks and, you know, yeah. I think you know, they, they say that women biologically are better at multitasking. Um, so I'm, I'm definitely like, yeah, I can basically have two conversations at once. And, um, so yeah, I'm really proud of being a producer. I, I, you know, and I, I, it's kind of part of my mission is to, to educate people, um, like what a producer is, what a producer does, and, and how much influence we have on a film. I mean, the director gets all the credit, which is great, you know, um, and, and I don't mind being behind the scenes. I, I like being, you know, the wizard behind the curtain, <laughs> for sure. Um, but I do think that, you know, people don't, and even filmmakers don't, uh, directors don't understand exactly what producers do, because they've never, there's, there's not a lot of us who, like, are soup to nuts, you know, and kind yeah. of, it's, it is such a hard job that you often like split it up with multiple people. And, mm -hmm. and, and frankly, like the job has gotten harder over the years. So I do like to partner with people when I produce, um, but I've produced several features just on my own as the only producer. That's hard. Um, yeah. it's, it's hard. It's on the one hand, it's hard. On the other hand, there's something really nice about being like you, it's just you and the director and the two of you are like in sync. Mm -hmm. um, and so there's something really nice about that too. So.